And for Jake, I'm so thankful when he goes out to lunch with his ex and I find out on Twitter. Looks like there's trouble in paradise for Tana Mongo and Jake Paul. You love me? Uh, yeah. Here's what you need to know. Jake was spotted at a birthday party with his ex-girlfriend Erica Castell. Later, they were photographed having lunch. Then on Sunday, less than a month after Jake and Tana tied the knot. This is my wife. Tana took to her Instagram story to sing about her past and present love life, a la Ariana Grande's Thank You Next. Thank you. The YouTube star replaced Ari's lyrics with her own and not so subtly hinted at her hubby's lunch with his ex. Thought I'd end up with Bella, <laughs> yet it wasn't a match. <laughs> Wrote some songs about Hunter. <laughs> now I listen and laugh. Even actually got married. And for Jake, I'm so thankful when he goes out to lunch with his ex and I find out on Twitter. Okay, so it sounds like the 21-year-old learned about the get-together on the internet. Ouch. She also references Bella Thorne, who she was in an open relationship with for over a year. I never fake cry. I only real cry. And Hunter Moreno, Tana's frequent collaborator with whom she has told fans she had a complicated on-and-off-again relationship. I allowed you to end things. <laughs> Are you f***ing kidding me, I Hunter? Like Jake and Tana said I do in Las Vegas on July 23rd. We're so f***ing conventional. Yeah. The two were supposed to jet off to Europe for their honeymoon. I think our honeymoon is the best part. Really? That's true. You know, they surprising her with a lot of honeymoon -ness. But Tana explained to fans via social media that she had a family emergency and had to stay back. Two weeks after their wild nuptials, Tana admitted she and Jake aren't legally married. And to everybody that's calling it fake because we rushed into it or because I don't do things traditionally because I wanted to not do it legally, but any wedding I have, if I had three more weddings, I really wouldn't want to do it on paper because I think that legally binding yourself to someone takes away the love.